Whether it was a lack of interest in the candidates or COVID-19 fatigue infecting politics, more than two-thirds of voters failed to show up at the ballot box in the first round of France's regional elections. President Emmanuel Macron's centrists were roundly rejected, failing to win more than 10% of the vote in many regions and trailing behind France's main opposition, Les Républicains, as well as Marine Le Pen's far-right national rally party. Although coming second, Le Pen had been hoping to make huge gains across the country, but instead saw a nine percentage point drop in support compared to the last regional elections, as voters stayed home. It's simply following a trend that we have been observing for a very long time, the immobilization of the young, of the old, of part of the middle class. Unfortunately, we reach a situation where if we don't wake up, things will get worse and we won't be in control of our destiny. I think it's a great pity that in our country there is so much abstention. I think it's a real shame, because where is the citizenship? Where is the republic? With no single party winning more than half the votes, all those that cross the 10% threshold head for a second round. But parties can now form alliances, which has often happened in the past, to stop the far right from claiming victory. Natalie Hewitt, Euronews.